Good to have your company on Fox Sports right around Australia and a very warm welcome to Archerfield Speedway near Brisbane. The 2016 Australian V8 Dirt Modified Championship. This will be a beauty. Let's start our coverage by checking out the last decade of champions and uh, the defending title holder is of course Jai Stevenson who won the crown at Geelong's Avalon Raceway last year. Here's more on that. Northern New South Wales native Jai Stevenson has firmly established himself as one of Australia's premier V8 dirt modified competitors. Last season, he achieved his childhood dream of winning an Australian championship at Geelong's Avalon Raceway after dominating all 35 laps. Stevenson admits that since his national title victory, he has noticed numerous changes. Ah, oh, mate, it's been good. We've been getting plenty of media, media exposure and, uh, yeah, just enjoying it for what it is. Um, it's a hard, hard thing to get, so, yeah, you want to take it... You can't take it for granted, so live it up while you got it. Despite the changes, Stevenson maintained there hasn't been an increase in pressure and he's happy to just continue going about his business. Yeah, we just try to bring a nice clean car to the track every meeting, keep it keep it looking very uh, presentable and uh, yeah, we're happy to talk to anyone that wants to come talk to us, help out other drivers. Um, yeah, it's just, just pass and parcel. No, nothing's really changed here. We've just, uh, we're just trying to keep, keep on going. Stevenson, a passionate fisherman, says his father has always been a major influence. With his dad even stepping out of his V8 dirt modified and letting Jai take his place behind the wheel, even if it took a little longer than Jai had wanted. Yeah, if everything panned out right, I would end up in, in his car, hopefully. I was thinking all along, but it uh, took him a while to give it away. But when he did, he um, yeah, gave me the reins and happy days since then. It's very much a family affair for the Stevensons, with Jai's brother Braid also competing as part of the Big River Steel team, a company that Jai runs in South Grafton. Yeah, a lot of late nights down the shed there, tinkering away, me and him, and uh, yeah, it's good. He's, he has a bit of a hard run, but um, yeah, he's starting to get the hang of it now and uh, working out what he's got to do through the week to keep the car going, so yeah. Stevenson says his fellow Northern New South Wales native, three-time Australian champion Mark Robinson, is one of his favourite drivers to race against, as is Queensland's Kevin Britton. Yeah, no, he's definitely tough, tough competition, and uh, yeah, definitely Kevin Britton. He's also, they're all, we're all every weekend we go race, and we always know that they're going to be right there on our left rear, right rear in front of us. Yeah, it's going to be close racing. Stevenson believes the key to backing up his 2015 success is to have spent as much time on the track as possible, something he believes he has achieved. Uh, for us, we just wanted to do as much racing as we could in the, the three meetings that we could possibly do in the week leading up to the Australian title. So we've done all three of them to get some lap time, and uh, a lot of the blokes chose not to, but uh, we thought more more laps, the uh, better we'll understand the car and uh, better I'll be able to drive it. The Troyer brand is synonymous with success in the class, and Stevenson says it's not just because parts are easy to access. Yeah, definitely the uh, dominant brand, but David Clark with his big nulls, they're going, they're starting to really come on. Like Dave, Dave's been national champion, so they're obviously a good car. And uh, yeah, there's a few other brands getting around, but uh, yeah, Troy is definitely popular. We can get the bits off JBR easy enough, and uh, yeah, no, they're definitely, definitely the breed of car you want if you've got a dirt modified at the moment. Speedway has always been a passion for the dirt modified star and he says he can't see anything changing in the future. Yeah, definitely, definitely Speedway of our dirt modifieds and uh, yeah, it'd be good maybe one day to step up into sprint cars but uh, yeah, at the moment the focus is on our dirt modifieds. <laughs>